birthday. Thank you. <laughs> 26. My old man. Got him his birthday Chick-fil-A. 10 chicken minis. That was sweet. It took five ever. Cause they made him with love. What are you doing at workouts? Uh, running and have lower body today. Lower body, he says. So hopefully the run is not too hard. Yeah. Then we're gonna go to the mall and get you a bathing suit. Yeah, today mall haircut. Your haircut. Drop car off. Drop car off. At Where? shop. That is my to-do list for today. That sounds like birthday. a plan. I am going to do some work and clean this pigsty of an apartment. <laughs> Please look at this laundry. This is ridiculous. This is two Lulu addicts right here. What it looks like since you line dry everything. Sorry. I mean, it's just as much my fault as it is yours. But yeah, and then we're gonna have a day. Oh, throw it back now. <laughs> I don't know how he does that. Ew, a chunk of the powder? Got in my throat. Goodness. All right, well, we'll pick this up when we're doing something exciting. I think I'm about to clean before work just to feel better about Ugh. the state of this apartment. So, yeah. Okay, back to this. Because <laughs> this is the literal best thing I've ever purchased in my life. It is like 30 bucks from Amazon. If you own a lot of like Lululemon or really any clothing that you need to line dry, this is such a game changer and it literally holds all of me and Jake's Lulu and then like dance stuff. So yeah, definitely worth it. But I'm gonna do a quick cleaning moment. Also, this is the candy bowl I was talking about. This is ridiculous. I just wanna like throw it all away, but I eat it every single day. We took down the Christmas tree last week. We had a flocked tree and there's still some remnants behind. So I think I'm going to vacuum the whole house. I have like all of my work stuff <laughs> behind here. This is so embarrassing. A random boot back there. Great, that's exactly where she goes. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna spruce up the place and <laughs> This is like real life right now. We got our suitcases out because we have yet to pack a thing and we literally leave in less than 24 hours. So just gonna do quick cleaning really fast and then catch up with y'all in a minute. Why are we, why are we, why are we surrounded by Finally clean. Oh my gosh, it feels a million times better in here. It's all spruced up, vacuumed, clean, disinfected. I was like still snapping in like snow and sparkles from Christmas, but yeah, it's all cleaned up now, thank God. I have to run to do some work out in the field. Um, I actually meet with my boss in like 30 minutes down the road just to go over um, the plan for the new year and all of that good stuff. So yeah, about to go see him now and then go get some work done and then start packing for Hawaii. We're so excited, but for now, off to work. <laughs> Hello. We 
are finally done with work for the day. It has been a freaking long day. Just tying up loose ends before I leave for 10 days. So I've been flying around all day, but I am about to go meet Jake at the tire place because he has to drop his car off there while we're gone and get his emissions engine. I don't even know. I'm not even gonna try to pretend like I know. We have yet to pack a thing in our suitcases, so that's really awesome. I'm one of two people. I either pack like two weeks in advance or I'm like two hours before. There's no in between. Something I need to work on, but it's not gonna be this trip, apparently. I think we're gonna go to the mall because he owns one bathing suit. And I'm like, dude, we're going for 10 days. You need at least a second bathing suit. So we're gonna hope there are some stores selling bathing suits. So yeah, we'll go there, probably pick up dinner on the way home, and then get to packing. I also need to shower and wash my hair, and I think I'm gonna try to do the air wrap on it and make it last for a few days so I don't have to wash it a lot out there, but we will see. Alrighty, as summer slams on the brakes, mm -hmm. uh, just got my hair cut. Rolled the dice and went to Great Clips because that's the only place I could get in at, and. It did okay, I guess. It always grows back, so. Um, getting my uh, my car taken care of, and now we're headed to Perimeter Mall to find a bathing suit for me, and summer, And clothes for me. And clothes for summer. Like, she doesn't have enough of those already. No, don't. She loves that clothes. That is her, that is her Tonight, vice. What should we get for dinner? I don't know. Birthday dinner. Nah, we'll do birthday dinner in Hawaii. Oh, we still have to eat dinner. McDonald's? <laughs> no, we're not doing McDonald's. We're not doing drive-thru food. No, I'm not gonna do it. We need to eat somewhat healthy. Cheesecake since... factory? You went from McDonald's to Cheesecake Factory. Because he said not drive-thru. Those are two ends of the spectrum. What about Kava? They have like healthy green bowls. No. That sounds horrible. <sighs> just because it sounds healthy, it sounds horrible. What is a grain bowl? It's like Chipotle, but just like different food. It's Mediterranean. It's the same uh... concept. <laughs> Or, um, chopped? No. Zoe's Kitchen? Uh, I don't think I've ever had Zoe's Kitchen. It's good. It's fire. You'd like it. I need calories, bro. I need calories. Okay. You know? Made it to the mall. Already done some damage. Oops. Jake needed a bathing suit, so... I've been wearing the same bathing suit for three years. Understandably, I had to get something as well. It only made sense. Yeah, yeah, it's gotta okay. keep it even, right? We're at Perimeter. It's our favorite mall in Atlanta. It's the best. All right, done at the mall. Got the most important thing. Got our dinner. Always. Love Chipotle. Summer, mm -hmm. what did you snag? We got a purse from Zara, a top from Lulu, and then a lot of stuff at Sephora, per usual. Ooh, lighting. Mm -hmm. I finally found a bathing suit. About time. And then Summer, Got me my birthday gift. She gets so frustrated with me because I refuse to shop anywhere but Lululemon. Um, all I like to buy quality stuff that'll last a long time, so that's what I get. But we are headed home now. Gonna crush some dinner and get to packing for Hawaii. Leave it. Yeah, we have not packed a single thing. It's It'll take me 15 minutes to pack, so I'm not too concerned about it, but yeah, I know girl. it takes summer quite a while, so. This lighting is just egregious, I gotta tell you. The shadows, Summer, please don't run into the back of the Chevrolet Suburban from 2001 with paint stains all over the back tailgate. I'm tired, it's been a long day. It's been a very long day, and yesterday was a long day. We didn't get to bed until like... 1.30. 1.30 because of the National Championship. So, it could be an early bedtime for me. Just doing it to a piece of Is that so? Okay, so we're all done with that. Here we go. Here's the birthday boy. There I am. Eating his meal he requested specifically. <laughs> Gourmet Chipotle, cause what else? Watching The Bachelor, episode two. I missed it last night. I honestly completely forgot about it. I always think it's on Tuesdays, or yeah. I feel like a lot of people probably watch that over Bachelor cause you can just watch it the next day. I have to eat Chipotle on the floor. But yeah, we're about to eat dinner, watch this episode, and then get to packing. Woo! <laughs> this is ridiculous. All right, so I got my suitcase out. Step one. I don't know if anyone 
else is like me, but I have to just like lay everything out because if I just start like filling a suitcase, I don't know what's in there. So I have to like lay everything out to see like what I have, what I'm missing, what I need more of, what I need less of. So I quickly realized that I had too many shorts so i put like three pairs back i think i'm just gonna bring five i think that'll be good for nine days however long we're going and then i have some dresses for dinner two purses and then like a little lulu fanny pack thing for hiking and then some tank tops either just like wear to the beach as cover-ups or walking around i have some shoe options i feel like i'm gonna have to cut maybe one or two pairs and then five bathing suits just because we're not going to the beach every day got a cover up and then some shorts tank tops for workouts leggings for workouts t-shirts for obviously sleeping whatever and then see this is what i'm talking about now i see that i need more sports bras because two is not gonna last so gonna get more sports bras and then this is a hoodie just in case it's cold rain jacket and then just like a smaller jacket for whatever so now it's just a matter of figuring out what else i need putting it all into there which honestly won't be too bad this is <laughs> this is the worst so this is like my big i've had this forever it's just like a huge toiletry bag and so i end up just like throwing <laughs> stuff in here i really need to figure out like a good like organization method honestly because it just ends up in hodgepodge so yeah i think i'm gonna organize that and then just add some of this stuff that i got today that's my makeup bag i usually put my makeup bag like on my in my carry-on when i go places because i usually like to like put up put on a little bit of makeup whether it's at the airport or like when we touch down or whatever just so i look you know, not dead. Bringing that and then also curling iron in case that does not work. And then brushes, hair clip, all the hair products. This I need to figure out. I got this like little travel jewelry case kind of thing and it's really nifty. It has like a zipper. You can put like bracelets and stuff in and then you put the necklace like right here and then it hangs down. So I'm going to try to put these two on that and then this is what's pissing me off. So I tried to put the earrings in the little slots and I tried to put these in and they just will not stick through. So I'm gonna have to like get a pin and just start jabbing holes into it. I don't know. Can you tell that I only wear gold jewelry? That's pretty bad. I need to expand my taste. And then just like techie stuff and then beach stuff, sunglasses, all the goods. Oh, hello. Hey there. You wanna show them how much you've packed so far? I got everything packed. I just gotta mm -hmm. fold up my shirts. He's got that. All right, and action. Jake wants to show. All of my fun stuff. So I got all my, my long sleeve, mostly grays and whites and blacks. I got my cutoffs, the same color schemes. And I got my regular t-shirts. I got gray, green, white, red, gray, another <laughs> light gray. <laughs> Lots of grays. What my collar shirts, black, red, and blue. My joggers. Then my commission pants for like date nights and stuff. Lovely. Green, blue, black, and khaki. Same colors again. Then all of my at e shorts. His two different colors of gray. His khaki B-Day gift. And then his two little swim trunks. Yeah, two swim trunks. <laughs> they're not my... little. They're 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 big. I just said little like they're like little banana hammocks or something. They're little. No, they're not. They're little. I rocked the banana. All right, she is packed and ready to go for the most part. Just gotta close her up. And then I think I'm gonna check an extra bag just with like, oh, shoes, hair, appliances, all of that. Got the fax card, you know, everything what? is all ready to go. Hi. Oh my God, it looks scary. I just did the Dyson on my hair. It looks very, very curly right now. So looking kind of scary. But I am waking up at 4.40, pray for me, to go to a 5 a.m. Orange Theory class. I don't know why I'm doing that myself, but mainly because we're going to be on a plane for eight plus hours and I'm going to get no other movement, so I figure this will be the only time. And it'll get me up out of bed because we have to be up at like six anyways to leave for the airport, so I'm like, might as well. But yeah, 
that is pretty much it. We're gonna, I think, pack up the car tonight. What shoes should I bring? Your nobles and like some flats or something. My all whites. Yeah. And my blacks in the suitcase. Yes. All right, well, we're ending off this B day, kind of. We didn't really do much for your birthday because we're doing it big in Hawaii. Mm -hmm. um, we're ending off and we will see y'all in the morning. Why are you trying to put your foot on my shoe? I'm not allowed to touch him. No. Heaven forbid I touch his Jordans. There's a lot of women. We're about to board. And then we have a layover in Los Angeles. And yeah. Are you excited? Mm -hmm. We had a pretty good check in experience. Clear had no line, which is amazing. We got Starbucks. Jake had his Chick fil A. It's been a good day so far. Hope we can keep this good luck going and not lose any luggage. Oh, not that's going to do like Always last word. That's the best way to do it. We're impatient. You hate waiting. We also don't have anything to put over head, so it's not going to do it.